So episode two of Blind Server with Pete Gustin. That's me. And we're gonna be talking about how good things can happen when you try. Try something different, especially. I mean, all the good things in my life have happened when I just kinda tried. When I left my job in radio and became a full-time voice actor, when I moved to California, and of course, when I decided I wanted to learn how to surf. I mean, this has been amazing for me. And another little story I wanted to tell was a surf competition that I just did about a month ago that I was completely unqualified for, but it was something I wanted to try. I signed up with the Carlsbad Board Writers Club and wanted to do this little competition with them. And I look at the heats, and there's people in the heat like Taylor Knox, former professional surfer. There's uh, uh, Keith Walker, president of JS Industries, and Brant Riley, a local amazing surfer. All these great guys. And I'm like, okay, I'm a little out of my league here. <laughs> Just a little bit. And on top of that, the waves were crazy that day. In fact, my girlfriend, Maggie, who I call Banana, can actually tell you what she saw when we got down there. Hey, Banana, you in there? Yeah. You wanna come out? Sure. It was, it was probably the biggest day we'd seen in this area. Tell them, <laughs> tell them about the waves at the competition. They were huge. Um, when we got there, I was like, uh, if you wanna bail, that's okay. I won't think any less of you. They were ridiculous and the ocean seemed super fierce. But I'm like, whatever, we're here, we'll give it a try. And it didn't go awesome. Maggie and the police ended up yelling at me, like the police, the, the state police were like, you're in a bad spot. I got like shoved way off to the side and it, I mean, it didn't go awesome. Caught one wave and it was fun, but I was really there too. Hi Skyler. I was there to, to meet people and get out there and try something new. And at the end of the whole day, this is why it was awesome to try something new. At the end of the whole day, they did a raffle. I won this. I won the grand prize in a raffle. It's this brand new board from JS Industries. And I was super excited. I got to get on the microphone. And Maggie's like, yeah, of course, you're on a microphone. We go in public and you're on a microphone again. And I get to <laughs> talk unusual. to everybody. Yeah, I get to talk to everybody and do a little speech. Thank you so much. This is great. And uh, they get, let me pick out any board I wanted. So actually, the guy holding the camera right now, Josh Servi, my friend and surf coach, why don't you come and explain what this board is? What do we pick out here? Yeah, so both of these other two and the other boards that you have had are just way shorter and smaller, kind of more uh, small wave orientated. So they got more width overall. Um, so nose width, tail width. This guy is much more shortboard orientated. Um, the, the rails are going to be a lot thinner, which is going to be a lot more sensitive to movement. Um, so, you know, you've been on something pretty user friendly for a while now. So you're going to challenge yourself a little bit with the with the black box. I did <laughs> notice that the front of this board, you said it's knifeier. Yeah, um, definitely. It comes to a point and I see they kind of blunted it. Did they do that for me so I don't stab anybody <laughs> or are they always blunt No, they did, that, they did that for me so you don't stab me. <laughs> so I don't stab you. Uh, okay. But a lot of times, yeah, they'll blunt it. I mean, it's not like it comes out to a perfect knife. You know, the last little tip of that is all just resin anyway, but they just want to make it a little bit more dull. That's right. So um, you, think, you think I can ride this thing? Yeah, yeah, we'll see what the waves give, but um, yeah, we'll see We'll see how far it's been, or how long it's been since you've had a extreme challenge with surfing. <laughs> All right, well, let's go hit the beach. <laughs> Hold on, I just got a email, and it is my trailer manager. So before, before we hit the beach, I gotta go record something real quick. Um, sorry, let me just go run up in the boat. I'll be back in about 10 minutes. All right, I'm done. I just finished the read. I can never disclose what I'm reading until it airs for uh, NDA reasons, non-disclosure agreement. So when it airs, I'll tell you. But for now, it was a company that starts with D and rhymes with Fizney. <laughs> yeah, let's hit the beach. Josh literally just asked me how he looked with the sunscreen on. I'm like, <laughs> awesome. He looked blurry as usual. <laughs> so, all right, we're, we're actually, you're not supposed to say the name of the spot when you're doing a YouTube channel because you don't want to oh. crowd the spot, right? Although, oh, I feel like. kind of got an indicator there. Oh, yeah. But I do <laughs> feel like if people knew where I was surfing, they'd just stay away. They're like, all right, the yeah. blind guy's there. Let's we get We always out of there. surf where it's best. Yeah. All right. So, we're in North <laughs> County, San Diego. If you happen to know what that pier is, well, then you know. But what are we looking at? There's some swell in the water right now, but it's like a six and a half foot high tide. So, we went to Tamarack in uh, Carlsbad and not many waves at all. So we came here, he just really wants to test out his new board. And uh, it's a little mushy, so for the short board, not the best necessarily, but obviously it'll hopefully work. We'll see if he can make it work. Um, Maggie wanted me to ask you what you wear under your wetsuit. Nothing. Because <laughs> <laughs> I wear I wear a speed I wear a speed uh. under my wetsuit. So like Yeah, no, like 
Well, some people do. Some people will wear, um, what's it called? Like, the waterproof type boxers. Oh, oh, I didn't know like, they had that. It's I just not, a, sexy not technically speedo. a speedo. Can I show off my speedo? Maggie, can I show off my speedo? <laughs> oh my god, please don't. Ready? No, I'm turning it off. Ah! Oh. Wave, jump. Hey, how was the surf? Oh, it was fun. I mean, the waves were a little, but this board's pretty badass. Uh, it's it's got a lot of maneuverability to it. I'd just love to get into some bigger waves and put some uh, put some real turns into it. But man, it gets into the waves. I had some fun to the left and right. Almost only crashed into one person today, so that was cool. And it wasn't me. And it wasn't Josh. Nice. Actually, I saw the silhouette of a person. I was like, ah, it's Josh. I'm going to like surf over to him. Maybe he can get me on the GoPro. I got right up next to the guy. I'm like, ah, I don't think that's Josh. <laughs> what, so I had this stupid string out so I could attach these pads to this thing. Yeah, there it is. And then apparently I left it on the ground and um, the dogs decided that they weren't dogs anymore, they were spiders, and they decided to make a wh Where does this thing end? I don't see the end of it. <laughs> How far does it go? Wait, is it inside? It was. Go get it. Oh my god. Okay, did I get the end? Yeah. Alright, there we go. Okay, good job, spider dogs. Okay. <laughs>